and the Port Commission has sent the city of Corpus Christi its white paper outlining its intentions concerning the Harbor Island desal project. City leaders have been angered by the Port's Harbor Island plan because of a number of reasons, and one is location, which city leaders have said would require a lot of in infrastructure to be built. Another is the cost of the project, which the Port estimated to be in the half billion dollar range. Meanwhile, the city is moving forward with its own desal plans, which call for a plant to be built in the inner harbor and for less than 200 million. And we spoke with the mayor today and a council member about the port putting on paper what its plans are for a desal plant. The white paper is basically everything they have been saying. It's just on a piece of white paper now. <laughs> so honestly, that's as simple as it gets. I just think that until we're working together, it's not a good idea to move forward. And until we're collaborating and we're on the same page, and I think the white paper just basically comes out, it still says we're not on the same page. City leaders want the port to totally abandon its desal project. Port officials have told 3 News that they're not going to do that, and that's because a ruling by the state on the port's permit request could come any day. The port feels it could end up being the only permit issued by the state for a desal plant to be built here. The city is still going through the permitting process and its planned project.